what appears to be vintage 1950s footage of a nuclear weapons test is actually U.S. Coast Guard surveillance video taken in 2007. An enormous explosion rocks the T2 laboratories in Jacksonville, Florida. We've got multiple explosions at this time. We're not able to get within probably a thousand feet of this thing right now because it's still exploding. There's nobody could survive what went on over there. The initial explosion is so powerful that pieces of machinery are sent flying and land several blocks away. The force of the blast actually bends and tears the walls of a nearby factory. Surveillance videos from adjacent buildings illustrate the magnitude of the explosion. Businesses within 300 yards of the T2 labs are ripped apart. The multiple victims still not accounted for, so we need to check all the structures in the area. A worker trapped in the plant has called 911 on his cell phone. I've got the victim on the floor with me right now. Both of his legs are injured. The planes are getting closer to me now. I'm on the, laying on the ground. There are four fatalities. 33 other people are injured. The man on the cell phone is rescued and survives with two broken legs. Okay, the victim. That is the victim we're looking for. Keep going, keep going, keep going. T2 manufactures Ecotane, a relatively stable gasoline additive, but the process used to create it can be extremely volatile. Industrial accidents don't occur frequently, but when they do strike, the damage they cause is often catastrophic. 